Hi, my name is Frank Schaefer, and I am an author and a writer. But I'm also something else. I'm someone who got polio when he was two years old because my parents, in 1954, right after the polio vaccine came in, didn't vaccinate me, not in time. We were on a boat on the way back to Europe where they were missionaries. But you know, as Kennedy goes into the hearings on whether he is going to be part of our government, and he is an anti-vaxxer and suspicious of science, I have a foot that is four sizes smaller than my right leg and foot to remind me that the greatest advance in medicine is probably vaccines, maybe antibiotics. You know, I was so happy when I got my COVID vaccine after having been at home for a year. And I, I want to show you something, and I know this is kind of weird, so forgive me for freaking you out, but I'm kicking my slippers off here and it just snowed today. And I'm going to step outside and show you the difference between a polio leg and a good leg. What both of my legs would have looked like if they'd been vaccinated. I'm pulling up my socks here. Okay, I'm stepping into the snow and that little foot here, this leg here, that's my polio leg and there's my good leg and there's the difference in footprints normal size and polio size and you know you'll see some scars here on my head that are left over from some surgery i had done in boston a couple months ago to remove a cancer here and the biopsy for that cancer basically saved my life because they got all the margins and i'm fine and uh, i know i look like a crazy old man today with my hair all disarranged but hey you're in my studio you're part of my family right now uh, but this Kennedy nomination is a real mistake, and it's a line too far. It's the one that scares me most, because whether it's the biopsy that found the cancer on my head or the fact that the COVID vaccine has kept me well, that I get the vaccine for pneumonia and the other things, that all my children were vaccinated. You know, I went to British private boys' schools back in the early 60s, and I remember being in sick bay, which was the sick room, and we all got measles, and then we got German measles, and we got mumps. And some people that got mumps, of course, were sterilized after that. And I remember the day when one boy had to be hospitalized and almost died with measles. You know, I'm 72 years old, and I've been around the block long enough to know that someone approaching my age, which Kennedy is, ought to know better. So, you know, there are cranks who are harmless, like my mom, who thought Jesus was coming back any day, and he didn't. And then there are cranks who are harmful, but they're only harmful if you put them in positions of power. So I just want you to take a look at my two feet and multiply that by hundreds of millions of people in an anti-vax movement. It's such a mistake. Uh, let my foot instruct you, my little polio leg, what I used to call my bad leg when I wore an iron brace up to my knee all through my childhood and my teen years and was so ashamed of that, got bullied because of it. Vaccines are good. And uh, people who question very basic science are really the enemy of our future. My name is Frank Schaefer.